Welcome back to Live Now from Fox. Happening today, a 19-year-old student who was accused of threatening to gun down people at Embry-Riddle University in Daytona Beach, Florida, is scheduled to face a judge this afternoon. Let's go ahead and check in with Fox's Randy Hildreth live out there in Daytona, Florida for the latest. Good morning, Randy. Yeah, good morning. John Hagen is waking up in the Volusia County Jail this morning. He is set to appear before a judge at 1.30 this afternoon. Uh, on charges, police say that he actually had a planned attack uh, to come to the campus here at Embry-Riddle University and was found to have had weapons. Uh, what we know this morning is that police say that he was headed to a firing range and then his next stop was the campus to enact what uh, the police chief called, quote, a Columbine, and that's a reference to the 1999 mass school shooting in Colorado. Now, at that news conference Thursday, Daytona Beach's police chief opened a backpack. The department says Hagen's was prepared to bring to campus inside a rifle, six full magazines of bullets and boxes with more than 200 more rounds of ammunition. He faces several charges this morning, including attempted first degree homicide. Police say a tip from students on campus helped them quickly jump into action. This is Randy Hildreth. Thank you so much for bringing us this update, and we'll check in with you a little bit later for the details. All right, guys.